Da Nang City is implementing the project for semiconductor development, developing human resources in cooperation with enterprises to form an ecosystem. It's among focuses of the project. Da Nang set the goal of becoming one of the three largest semiconductor centers in the country by 2030. Following the projects, the city will form a network to train high-quality human resources in semiconductor associated with the synchronous uh, development of the semiconductor ecosystem, in which universities will develop training programs meeting the needs of businesses. The plan also includes supporting training costs for those studying this measure, among many others incentives. The U.S. exited China to become the biggest importer of Vietnamese agroforestry and fishery products in the January to August period with the value of nearly 8.6 billion U.S. dollars. Figures from the Ministry of Agriculture and Rural Development show that total export revenue of agroforestry and fishery products reached over 4 billion US dollar in the first 8 months of the year, marking a year-on-year -year increase of 18.6%. Export to most markets gained significant growth in the 8-month period, such as Asia, Americas, Europe and Africa. The US is set at China to become the biggest importer of Vietnamese agroforestries and fishery products in January to August period, with value of 8.58 billion US dollar, surging 23.5% on year and accounting for 21.4% of the total. China ranked second with 8.17 billion US dollar, followed by Japan with 2.68 billion US dollar. Krom Park Durian Festival 2024 attracts over 200,000 visitors. Vergistaba Village in Hoi An attracts foreign tourists. The second Krom Park Durian Festival theme, Krom Park Durian Development and Integrations, closed on September 2nd in Krom Park District in the Central Highland Province of Daklak. The event attracts over 200,000 visitors. The second Krom Park Durian Festival 2024 features a wide variety of rich, diverse and attractive activities including a fair showcasing one commune, one products, products and local agricultural potentials with over 400 booths from organizations, businesses and cooperatives from both within and outside the province. This year's Krong Park Durian Festival also aims to introduce the region's potentials and advantages to tourists, businesses and investors from both within and outside the country, showcasing the friendly and hospitable image of the local people. In the first eight months of this year, the number of international tourists to Ningbing increased dramatically with nearly 828,000 arrival, three times higher compared to the same period in 2023. Among the international tourist groups to Ningbing in the past eight months, the most notable is the group of Indian billionaires visiting Ningbing from August 28 to September 3rd with an estimated total of about 4,500 people. Ningbing province has implemented a strategy of diversifying products and services towards quality and professionalism, constantly adding more nighttime products and services. The image and tourism brand of Ningbing have been continuously promoted on mass media, including digital platforms such as Facebook, YouTube, major travel websites in the world, which have attracted international tourists to the province. 
Chakwe, a vegetable village, is the place that nature loves you find hard to ignore. By coming there, you can experience authentic village life in Vietnam, the 400 years old village, therefore, attracts more and more foreign tourists to visit and enjoy in exciting activity. This is the first time Carson and his family visited Hoi An. The activity of planting vegetables has become an unforgettable memory for him. Uh, it feels very traditional and I feel like this is a really unique experience. And um, it feels very cultural and, and it just makes, and it feels like really nice. Uh, we tried uh, making the vegetable garden um, and we watered the plants um, with the their local watering systems. We are very impressed. Uh, quiet life and hard working. Chia Kue Vegetable Village is located in Kem Ha Commune, Hoi An City. The local household has utilized this over 40 hectares area to implement crop rotation and intercropping with more than 20 types of leafy vegetables and spices for nearly 400 years. And for more than 20 years, Chia Kue Vegetable Village has been exploited, become a specialty of Hoi An tourism. Is that okay with your shoulder first? They come here to work with us, so I happily welcome them. I can also earn a few thousands US dollar per year by providing these tours, so it's quite okay to me. The simple farmers in the village have also mastered the art of joining with travel companies to welcome and guide tourists to experience festivals growing. This special tourism model in Chakwe has become an attractiveness to European and American tourists. That's the end for today. Thanks for your watching and see you next time.